Good morning, everyone. I'm in the car, about to go get me a hot chocolate. Then I'm gonna run to the office and follow up on some stuff there. And then at noon, I'm gonna meet some gals and some guys, I'm sure, for lunch because at 1.30 today, we're gonna do a quick little video in downtown Mesquite saying, Welcome to downtown Mesquite. I actually don't know how we're doing that, but we're saying welcome to downtown Mesquite in the video. So it's going to take all of like 10 minutes, maybe. So um, yeah, that's what we're going to do today. But first, let's go get a hot chocolate. I'm out here at the house and my phone has died. So um <laughs> can't really take pictures, but we've got the, the hardware um, about to go up and like the vent covers. We've got the toilet paper roll stuff already in place, but they're putting the knobs and the pulls on today. And putting up the ceiling fans. And I guess later today they'll put up the rods for the clothes. And yeah, so I'm just checking out everything going on. I'm kind of bummed that the camera died. But I did get a picture of the sconces out front so I can send that to Martin, which I know he'll be excited about. So. All right, just gonna check out this. Oh, and we're putting the towel around the fireplace, so, yeah. You use like a little template? Oh. Cool. Very cool. and I'm getting my stuff out of the car because I need to do a little bit of work before I go to my video shoot. And a funny thing happened. My phone died. I did not charge it up appropriately overnight. So now I've got to go charge my phone and drink my hot chocolate and center myself and get some work done. So let's go do that. Close the old door. Look. Go to the office. All right, got my hot chocolate in hand. Couple of minutes, couple of seconds, and then Arlo's in there. Jump in, and they will say, How's that sound? We need a practice run. I think so. Okay, kids, rehearsal time. <laughs> what are we doing? Okay, so let me Everybody, get Where your are we going to be standing? <laughs> We're going to be over here. Let's kind of do it through. What do you say? Yippee-yay. American title right now because I have to sign some documents for a closing that's coming up and the documents are here Marvin's already signed it's for our house so um, our old house current house the one we're in now so anyway I'm gonna sign the document real quick and then I'm gonna stop by the gray house to uh, see the progress that has happened today and I might stop by like Hobby Lobby to see what they have going on there too because I haven't been there in a while I'm out at the house now and I thought I'd give you a tour because we've had some changes today. So let me just show you what they've done. This is of course the front door. It is craftsman style, but we did not put the denture molding right there or whatever it's called. We just have the three windows. And then sconces were put in on each side. And let's go in and see what else they've done. So 
that's the back of the door and that's the entryway. I'm gonna put a little table over here with a mirror on top of it. And then that's our clothes closet. And of course our front door walks right into the living room. And we have the fireplace. They've added the glass, gray glass tiles to it. That goes back to the master in the laundry room, but I'll show you that in a minute. I don't know what I'm gonna put here, but our couch will be like right here, and then a couch right there, or chairs or whatever, and then maybe some chairs by the window. We'll see. And then this is the kitchen, and our little side counter here. The refrigerator is gonna go back there, and cooktop is back there, microwave, and then the oven goes right there. Uh, and this over here is a built-in hutch and a dining room table will go here. We have not bought one yet Back here is a little mud bench area and Got the hooks up already Two cabinets at the top which I cannot reach But that's okay. We can put our shoes under there and then the little powder bath back there It just has the little vanity and the toilet Coming back into the kitchen area, I have my double sink. I love it, I love it so much. This is where the dishwasher's going and this is going to be the trash, uh, recycle and the trash bins. They're gonna go tucked away into there. This of course is where my cake pans, baking pans will go. And then back here, this is the door to the guest bedroom. This is the door to the office. This is the door to our pantry. So it looks great. I'm excited about it. Of course, lighting is not on yet, but that's okay. Guest bedroom, we picked out the bed for this area and the nightstands that are gonna go with it. Guest vanity, they've put the lights up. And they've got the clothes rods here in the closet. And of course, Jack and Jill restroom, the tub. They have not cleaned up like the grout work and stuff, but they'll do that soon. They're doing that in the coming week, he said. And this is the vanity area for my office. And of course, as I've mentioned before, this is the cat area. I'm gonna be putting the cat boxes right underneath there and putting like some sort of Sherpa blanket or something so the cats can lay there and look outside. My desk is gonna go over here. I don't know if I'm gonna get an L-shaped or just a straight desk right there. And maybe like a chair or something over here. I don't know yet. I need some of my designer friends, some of my more decorating savvy friends to help me out. But in my office closet, I just have shelves. I don't have any rods. So plenty of storage area. Okay, coming out of the office, we go back into, oh, and I don't know, like should I put like a little table here? I don't know, am I trying to fill up every available space? Maybe so. So this goes back into the living room, of course, and we go across here. If I go to the right, it's the bedroom, and if I go to the left, it's the laundry room. So let's go to the bedroom first. Come in here, I've got the ceiling fan already up. And we're going to put our chest of drawers right here and possibly a TV. And we're keeping our master bed set with the two nightstands on either side. But look, the barn door is up. It is gorgeous. I'm in love. I'm completely obsessed with that. No, just whatever. But anyway, I'm so excited it's up. And then this is the master vanity with the lights and the stuff restroom they have not started grouting or the final grouting yet they're going to do the cleaning and then they do the final grouting for the flooring and stuff and then this in here is our closet we've got rods hung up these are removable rods and shelves so like in the winter like towards christmas time Marvin kind of wants to put like a little stand here so we can put like a little small tree. Just so when people are driving by, they'll be able to see a tree. And that's kind of fun, so I'm okay with that. And we have shelves here for shoes and such. And then we have a shelf up here 
and of course shells all across the top but yeah so this is Marvin's because he's taller and then I get the lower one and then this is for all of our hanging clothes which will fit everything we have plus we have like hanging here and hanging here and hanging there we're having a chest of drawers here a chest of drawers over here they match and then you go through this wonderful pocket door into the laundry room area this is missing the rod they were supposed to put a clothes rod right there but they'll put it in because i'll remind them and then this let me turn on a light goes back to our secondary closet which is again more room for shoes i'll put my lesser worn shoes here it's just not my everyday stuff and then of course out of season or off season clothing will go here taking you back out that goes to the bedroom and this goes to the rest of the house the updates for today are they put the hardware throughout the house they tiled my fireplace remember we were going to put that marble herringbone and that didn't quite work out so we went back to the graphite glass tile from floor and decor and they got just everything looking so great so i think the counter guy the granite quartz guy is going to come out because there should be a where is it back there is another quartz countertop that they didn't put in the other day so he's bringing that i think tomorrow there was a scratch on this thing so he's supposed to see if he can't fix that i hope he can because it was expensive and then on saturday is when we actually have the carpet guy coming either Friday or Saturday, but I think he said Saturday. And so we'll have carpet going in on Saturday, and then we'll also have um, the first cleaning, like they're gonna do all the cleaning, so that the tile guy can start grouting the uh, floors and, and such throughout the house. But he needs everything to be cleaned first. And then we'll start doing walkthroughs and punch out walkthroughs where we just like oh this needs to be fixed oh this needs to be changed or this wasn't done or blah 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 and then um, we're getting so much closer to closing he said we might even be able to close the same week that we closed on our other house so that would be amazing so i'm looking forward to that um not much else is going to happen tonight i'm going to go home and fill out a couple um pieces of paperwork that i needed didn't get done today and just gonna plan we're gonna kind of map out we got the appraisal back on the mulberry house which is our current house and it made value so what i'm so excited about that so now we know kind of our budget for new furniture so i'm gonna get with marvin and like decide and prioritize what kind of new furniture we want to get first and what all fits into the budget and stuff like that so that's going to be probably not exciting um well i mean i'll be looking at websites and you could look with me if you wanted to i guess i guess i could film that but i'm probably not gonna so i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here thank you guys so much for watching i'm getting so excited about the completion of this house i'm crying no i'm not it's my eyes watering but i'm getting so excited about it it's almost done it is almost done so we're getting so close I can't wait to do like a final like full reveal and show you guys how I'm decorating um, or not decorating because I still need ideas so if you have any let me know and thank you guys so much for watching I know I already said that but I really do appreciate it and I'll see you tomorrow bye